Good evening, everyone. This is Royce Miller coming back at you with yet another Let's Try. Tonight on the docket we have ba -da -ba -ba, Wendy's. Where's the beef? You know, that lady actually had a cameo in a horror movie around a killer snack food called The Stuff. Where she was in a uh, where she was in a commercial for the stuff with Abe Vigoda, and she said, "Where's the stuff?" Because you know, like it, it wasn't a very good movie, but it had an excellent skewering of marketing campaigns and like all that stuff. Um, anyway, uh, tonight. So, what is it that we're having from Wendy's? Why well, it is a nacho burger and queso fries? Yay! Uh, I'll be honest with you, I've had some very bad experiences with the Wendy's in my area. So when I pulled up and it took them a minute to get my food, I was worried that they were going to ask me to pull forward, which I was going to be very mad about because, like, in the past I usually get chicken sandwiches from them, and I can kind of understand that they, if they had just run out of chicken and needed to drop more. But if they had run out of burgers and fries... And wanted me to pull forward, I would have been pissed. Anyway, let's take a look in a book reading Rainbow. So as you can see, oh sorry, I forget that this one's all, uh, this. There we go. Okay, so as you can see here, we have a cheese-covered bun. We have little tortilla strips. Take a look under the hood here. You can see tomato. You can see tomato, chip, some kind of like chipotle mayo it looks like, tortilla strips, cheese, and queso sauce. Let's try it out. Mmm. Spicy, cheesy, naturally, but honestly the standout here is this Asiago bun. This is amazing. Mmm. Also, I'm hungry, so I'm eating a little fast tonight. Sorry. I originally was going to order a double. Um. Wait a minute. But they, uh, but they were like, oh, if you order the single, you get a free fry. And I'm like, okay, I like fries. But I think I did it wrong. I think you had to sign into an account to get it. This has corn nuts on it. Look at that. That is a corn nut. So that's the crunch. Because, like... This is still crunchy. This sat in my car on the way to work. This sat on the desk while I talked to my supervisor and loaded the washer. And they're still crunchy. Mmm. That is phenomenal. Not too spicy. Pretty cheesy. Mm. Also, instead of a... Uh, fork. They gave me two straws for my queso fries. Oh. I guess they wanted me to eat them with chopsticks, but luckily I had a fork at work. Looks 
looks like this is some like jalapenos and <clears throat> regular cheese as well as the queso cheese. The only problem with notch with uh, the cheese sauce on their fries is that their cheese sauce is kind of salty, so it just tastes like salt on salt. I detect no difference from their uh, Baconator fries or their regular cheese fries, other than the lack of bacon, obviously. Mm. And the little peppers aren't really adding much. Of course, it could just be that I already had spice in my mouth, so I can't tell that there's more spice now. But there's, there they are, so you can see them. I don't think they're jalapenos. I think they're just diced green pepper. Or green bell pepper, sorry. Mm. That was delicious, though. I should have gotten the double though. That was a ah. some fries in the bottom of the bag. That was pretty good. Um, so what are my thoughts? I think the nacho burger is very good. Um, those corn nuts add a, keep the crunch coming, even if the tortilla strips kind of get lost a little bit in the... Because, you know, they get soggy and stuff pretty easy with the cheese and the, and the chipotle mayo. Uh, Wendy's burger patty is always delicious. I do wish they'd cook them a little crunchier, because I love a crunchy burger, you know. I like smash burgers. I, I like I like something that's crispy, well done. You know, I, I know a lot of people are like, oh, you got to have your burgers rare. No, 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 no. You have your burgers well done with a good crust. Um, because, like, texturally, it's pretty... The only thing that's really adding anything to that are the Asiago bun, which was amazing. Like, I think that Asiago bun might be the MVP of the sandwich. And the, uh, and the, um, uh, the, and, and the corn nuts, which stay crunchy even when they're soggy. Everything else is kind of just mush, which isn't necessarily bad. I mean, like, like we all eat cheap chicken salad or tuna salad or what, what have you. Uh, I think that's going to be it for me today. Oh, and as for the queso fries, sorry, I should mention the case fries too. Uh, the case of fries were kind of meh, you know, like, because it's, it tastes just like the normal cheese sauce and made with some, like, I don't know, I don't know what they are, chilies or poblanos, maybe. Uh, my main guess is green bell peppers because I got no heat from them or flavor. So that tells me that they're a very bland pepper, probably, so pr most likely a bell pepper. And because they're green, green bell pepper. Which is the worst of the uh, bell peppers. We all know that the red ones are the sweetest. But that's going to be it for me today. Uh, thank you all so much for tuning in. This is Royce Miller. I'm Audi.